Welcome back. A missing package and a rejected refund claim led a Mashpee man to seek help from the NBC10 Boston response team. Consumer investigative reporter Leslie Gata stepped in to get his money back. Let's take a look at the story. A pricey pair of shoes was delivered somewhere in Mashpee in September, but Bruce Rosenfeld says he didn't get them. This was the first time I've ever had a problem with, with delivery. I bought the shoes on September 16th. They were supposedly delivered on September 19th. He ordered the $600 pair from Saks Fifth Avenue. His tracking information says the shoes were left at the front door and included a photo of a box on a porch. He contacted Saks. I called him maybe six or eight times. I've sent maybe five or six emails. Uh, I was on the chat, on live chat uh, and, and automatic chat two or three times. It's frustrating because I had pictures of where the shoes were delivered and pictures of my house and the front porch where they said it was delivered, which were clearly different. Bruce says he tried to contact the shipper, too, but was told that only Saks could put a trace on the package since they sent it. He filed a claim with Saks, but it was denied. The company telling him, after thoroughly researching your refund claim, our team has determined that we are unable to issue a refund. Please know that our decision was made in accordance with our policies and a wide variety of factors were considered. They obviously felt that I received the package and I had not. They know that they've delivered to me many, many times and never had a problem. So I, I was a little bit taken aback by the fact that they um, weren't going to honor this. Bruce contacted NBC10 Boston Response for help. I reached out to Saks about the situation and several hours later, the company sent me an email saying the issue had been resolved. They sent me an email and a text. They apologized for what happened. Um, they said that they were going to refund the shoes. And at the same time, they issued me a $250 gift certificate to Saks which was very nice. It was a great result. It was just amazing. I can't believe you resolved it so quickly. That's because Leslie's good. But I have to say, Leslie, I mean, another success story, but it really shouldn't have to come down to that. And Saks is a, a, you know, a big luxury store. The frustration is real in these situations because you just can't get it resolved yourself. We are always happy to give it a try, to step in, to try to help you out. And in this case, a success. If you have a consumer problem that you can't resolve yourself, let us know about it and we'll try to help you. Go to NBCBoston.com slash contact response. That's where you can fill out our consumer complaint form and we will get back to you. Leslie Gatiss, NBC 10 Boston.